So I'm here at the tree, and I'm just about to have lunch with my good buddy Jeff Golfman. So let's go see what they have. Wow, looks pretty we're awesome today. Sweet salad. Hey, I'm amazed that we're going to be having this wonderful food. Turmeric limeade with stevia, phase one. Look at that, glowing. And this is Rayla? Raylan. Raylan from oh, Canada. We're about to take a sip for the first time. So. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. That's not bad. It's actually really good. I'm impressed. Turmeric limeade, folks. You hear it here first. It is really so, good. So, uh, Jeff, I, we, we thought what was uh, av avocado, we both kind of put it all over our our little nori wrap here, and it turned out it was wasabi. I um, I was banking on that being avocado. <laughs> <laughs> and it's a lot more spicy than I thought. It started coming out of the ears, the nose, the eyes, everywhere. Yeah, so we've, uh, you know, we've kind of reformatted a little bit the, uh, the lunch situation. So and here we are with Elena Loves joined us. Hello. From purejoyplanet.com. I don't have any wasabi on my plate. <laughs> But it's a great meal. It's good feel food. What I can tell you is this seaweed salad, honestly, one of the best seaweed salads I've ever had in my life. And I'm a big fan of the seaweed salad. So I'm going to go back for a lot more, hopefully beat the lineup so I can get a lot of it. So we just had a really good meal here with the tree and a good discussion, Jeff and I. And, you know, it's interesting because here we are eating this great meal. And I can't help but wonder... How, how are people going to eat this? Well, of course, I don't even eat this great when I'm in my own house and preparing stuff. And, you know, even with the superfoods that we have, the overall question is, how do we stay healthy? How do we manage to do this on a day-in, day-out basis, every day as a lifestyle? And, 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 more importantly, know what, what the answer is. Because I was just reading on uh, a fitness blog today, actually, um, this morning, the, the kind of the, the, the thread was, does anybody really know anything about nutrition? And the, the overall sentiment is, here we are, after 40, 50 years of study and health and doctors prescribing what is the perfect diet and how we should eat, we're nowhere closer to having a healthy society than we were 50 years ago, I mean, we're arguably worse. Our cancer rates, our diabetes, yada, 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 a whole thing. We know that. We're looking at all of us. Everybody I know is looking at doing something, something to improve their health. That's what we're all looking for. How do we improve our health? Isn't that right, Jeff? Hi, my name is Jeff Golfman. I have a blog site called The Cool Vegetarian. And I've been a vegetarian for 21 and a half years now. Raw food for... Uh, the better part of six and a half years, 100%. I'll be 43 years old in a few weeks. Most people think that I'm in my late 20s, early 30s. I have the energy of somebody in their 20s. I run races. Sometimes I win races. Three days ago, I came first in my age group in a four-mile race up in Tucson in the hills and the altitude. It was, it was wonderful. And for me, um, what's always a challenge is how do I stay healthy? How do I stay young? How do I stay fit? And so I, I eat the raw foods, I try to be low fat, I try to have low on the stimulation program, I exercise every single day, I do yoga every day, I try to uh, do massage and chiropractic and acupuncture when I can, I try to meditate and try to keep everything in balance. And that's basically my program. I was recently tested by uh, the doctors for all of my... Um, uh, nutrition levels and my vitamin B12 and my calcium and my iron and my proteins and my uh, cholesterols and everything is in range so I know I'm doing doing super good and just want to keep on getting healthier and happier and stronger and faster. So yet <clears throat> you have all this stuff you look great you're you're working out we, we went running in uh, Michigan not that long ago and you, the doctor in Canada, you were saying, said you had the healthiest blood he's ever seen. Yet you come here, and what were the results? <laughs> well, I was just tested here at the Tree of Life yesterday, and they're telling me that um, that I have hypoglycemia, that um, my sh blood sugars don't stay high enough long enough, and that um, I'm too alkaline. 
I guess the amount of greens I've been uh, eating and the amount of green juices I've been having are making me too alkaline, so I got to back off the alkalinity just a little bit. And that I have some adrenal fatigue, and that could be from the exercise. So we're going to rebalance all that stuff and, and work on all that. But these are things that the regular doctors have no say to do whatsoever. Yeah, and the point is that here you are doing everything right, and yet you come here, you find out some of the things, you make the adjustments, as you were saying, and you feel better. Yeah. I mean, isn't that amazing? Yeah, I mean, uh, I've been working with Dr. Gabriel Cousins uh, for six years. Since I went raw, I wanted to do it really properly, so I consulted with a whole bunch of different doctors. Uh, Dr. Gabriel, I, I talk with him uh, twice a year about my health and all my results, and we make tweaks to my program and adjustments to my program. And it's been amazing for me. Um, it's been super helpful for me and my health. And I continue to get uh, healthier and stronger each and every day. So just, just if you're, um, wow, the sun's bright. If you're struggling with your own health issues and trying to figure it out just like we are, know that it's, there's no end point. There's no point in which you get wherever you're supposed to get. This is a journey we're all looking to um, be healthy. And we're all struggling, or not struggling, but working through and and trying and experimenting and finding our own ways. So let's keep going and uh, good luck and let's let the goal be as healthy as we can possibly be. So my health goal is to be as young as possible for as long as possible, as strong as possible, and as fit as possible for as many years as I possibly can. I want to enjoy life while I'm here. I want to live life while I'm on the planet, and I want to be strong and mobile into a ripe old age. Yay! I love it. So, we have an interview with our next budding entrepreneur, raw foodist, Enoch. How you doing, buddy? Can you show everybody what you've been eating for lunch? Yeah, All right. What have you, you been eating? This. Oh, what is it? Wow. Do you like it? Yeah? So it looks like um, little cherry tomatoes and some olives. Is that is that something you like to eat for lunch sometimes? Yeah. Good. Well, that's awesome. Thank you.